What's up and welcome back to another video today. This is a little bit of a vlog style shoot here and that's for a very specific reason because we're talking about my favorite camera accessory of all time and it's very very useful when shooting vlog style. <clears throat> so what we're talking about today is the Peak Design camera straps. Uh, you probably are familiar with these little red tabs. You've probably seen them on Instagram, on YouTube, in various pictures all over the place and you might have wondered what they are. Well that's what we're going to talk about in this video. Okay, so there are a few things that make the, uh, the Peak Design camera strap system so fantastic. The main thing, the main thing here is that's all it takes to get it off. So if you're shooting a video, like you're vlogging or whatever, or taking pictures or any number of things, you wanna set your camera down, you don't have to fight to get this off. I can't hold my camera and get this off at the same time. It's just not possible. So I have to kind of do this little shimmy thing to get it out. And even then, it's kind of a challenge. But this is completely remedied with being able to just unhook it like that. Then I can set my camera down, go do whatever I want to do. And I don't even have to take this off. This has got a little magnet in it that sticks to itself and it becomes a bracelet so you can just wear it around. It stays on pretty well. Occasionally it will come undone, especially if you catch it on something, but it holds itself together pretty good, especially for being a camera strap. Another pretty obvious reason for having a camera strap is protection. You gotta save your equipment, protect it from falls and drops and different things. And this exact strap saved this camera and lens, this entire combination here from falling on some rocks in Ireland. I was shooting some vlogs, if you haven't seen them, go check them out on my channel. Subscribe if you haven't already. So I was in the middle of shooting stuff, in between shooting stuff, I was walking along holding the camera by the tripod. Somehow, this little button here on the back of the tripod got pushed. And you know what happened? It fell off. I was left, I was walking down these rocks, holding my tripod and my camera just like this. And that would have been utter doom. There was water around. It would have just been a complete disaster. I know that so many vloggers uh, just hold the camera like palm it on the back of the camera like this especially with point and shoots, or just wing it with the tripod and hope that nothing bad happens. I don't understand that. There's rarely ever a time that I'm not tied to the camera in some way or another, especially after my little mishap. Well, that's obvious and all camera straps do that. All camera straps provide some level of protection. This one is particularly nice because you can set your camera down like we talked about earlier, or you can easily switch from one camera to another. So this here is the leash camera strap. This is the actually the thinnest camera strap they make. It's a little uncomfortable with big heavy lenses, but it does a pretty good job and it's still reasonably comfortable. Uh, this thing is plenty long enough that even a pretty big guy like me can throw it over uh, your shoulder and still have plenty of room to move this around, take pictures and do whatever you want. But say you don't want to do the, uh, the whole camera strap around the neck thing and you got some free hands while you're wandering around. You can just undo that one, hook this one up, and then you are tethered to it with the wrist strap alone. You don't need this anymore. I mean, what did that take me? I was talking to a camera. I wasn't even looking at what I was doing, but I changed the camera strap system in like 10 seconds. Can you do that with any other strap? Not one that I've seen. So this is a game changer. When I'm shooting videos and taking pictures, especially on vacation, when I'm switching back and forth between cameras or using them in diff different situations or need my hands and want to put it over my chest, this thing literally takes seconds to just jump over from one to the other. Ooh. And I'm ready to go. Look at that. And so just like that, in a couple of seconds, I can drop this thing off to my side, not have to worry about it, take some pictures when I want to, set it on the side, hold a snack in one hand and my wife's purse in the other while we continue to wander about the city. So, so freaking convenient. It's 
unbelievable. I'm just so happy with this thing. You can also get wider straps too. They've got two wider sizes. Um, I'm just gonna show pictures of them because I don't remember what they're called. And the build quality is absolutely top notch. Second to none, we've got leather, we've got nice textured rubber, we've got aluminum, we've got this super hardy seatbelt material, more metal. These little uh, quick disconnect um, ropes here have our two-tone colors, so the middle of them is red. So if it gets to wearing out, you can easily see it and replace it before it breaks off. But you shouldn't have that problem. These are supposed to hold up to 200 pounds, which is crazy and way more than any other regular camera strap holds. I'm not gonna rip this one apart unless you guys really want me to. If you wanna see one of my other camera destruction videos in that same vein of things, go check it out. And I also wasn't sent these by, uh, by Peak Design. I just, I bought these about six months ago, been using them ever since, love them to death, and I'm just now finally getting around to doing a video on them. So speaking of buying this myself, the price isn't that bad. It's a little bit more expensive than your standard straps, but the features and convenience of them uh, way, way outweigh, way, way outweigh the, uh, the downside of having to pay a little extra. If I remember correctly, the wrist strap here was $29. The leash was $39, which isn't that far out of the realm of a nice camera strap. You may, you may spend you know, about $10, $15 less for regular stuff, but the interchangeability of this absolutely is worth that extra $15 or even $20. So if you guys are interested in some of Peak Design's camera straps or wrist straps or other strappy products, uh, check the links down in the description. It helps support this channel. Grab one for yourself, you won't regret it. Get one for some of your photography friends for Christmas because they will absolutely love it. This product is an absolute 10 out of 10 stars. Totally worth it. Huge thumbs up. Uh, it just makes sense. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked the video. Give me a like if you did like it. Hit subscribe if you're not already subscribed so you don't miss any more content and we'll see you in the next one.